Hey everybody. As you know, Jesus said, go out into all the nations and make disciples. And I think that's kind of interesting because you might assume that he's going to say, spread the gospel and cause conversions to happen, get people born again. And his instructions certainly do include that, but they go farther. And they, uh, the, the command is to go out and get people born again and then to disciple them, to create disciples. In other words, to set up uh, systems for teaching and preaching and caring for this new, uh, these new converts. And our calling in this, you have, we each have one of two callings. Some people are called to actually go to the missions field. Some people uh, have it on their heart to be there and to uh, go to these distant lands and to do this kind of work. Other people have a different kind of calling, and that is to send. Paul said, how can the gospel preached be preached unless somebody goes, and how can somebody go unless we send them? And he sort of set up this twofold ministry uh, uh, operation where some are called to go and some are called to send. And what I encourage you to do right now is to think about uh, and, and to seek uh, the counsel of the Holy Spirit. What is your calling? Are you a person that's supposed to actually physically be in the missions field? Or are you a person who's supposed to stay here and engage in work, engage in commerce, and acquire funds that support somebody uh, to be in the missions field? Think about how many, if, if this were really being fulfilled, think of how many people we could send. I know lots and lots of people whose heart is to go. They feel a calling, not just to be doing God's work somewhere, but a lot of these folks have a, a specific place that's on their heart. They know they're supposed to be in China or in Indonesia or in some far off place. Well, why aren't they there? The reason they're not there is because nobody is creating the funds that support them in, in, in being sent there. And so I would, if, if you haven't already resolved this issue, and if you're not operating in your calling, I would get before your king and settle this matter. Are you called to go or are you called to send? And then with the support of the Holy Spirit, get in that assignment and let's start producing some fruit for the kingdom.